Joram, son of Jehoshaphat, became king of Judah. Joram did not obey God and lost a lot of territory when the nations revolted against him. After Joram retired as king, Ahaziah became king over Judah and took Joram's place. Every day I'm shuffling. Joram and Ahaziah of Judah joined forces to fight Aram, which is now modern-day Syria. Meanwhile, Elisha sent a messenger who was told to kill the entire house of Ahav and anoint Yehu. Yehu was a Judean commander and brother of the king of Judah. At this time, both king of Israel and king of Judah are in Jezreel. Yehu then goes to Jezreel and kills both Yoram and Ahazreel. Yahu finds Jezebel and has her killed too. Nay, 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 nay. <laughs> Yahu sends a letter to find who from Ahab's family was still alive. Those from the family of Ahab who were alive were then killed and their heads were sent to Yahu. Yehu gathers the priests of Baal at the great Baal temple and has them all murdered and the temple destroyed. <laughs> Yehu spends the rest of his life fighting Aram. Oh, yeah, I know. I was, like, thinking. I was, like, she, I'm actually so smart. Hey! Turn it off! Make it stop! Make it stop. Yoram retired. You are now king. Long Papa, you don't have to read that king. part. <laughs> Dave is the guy that's Dave! <laughs> Not show the slow class. Let's go eat the bloopers. <laughs>